हेलो माय हस्बैंड बॉट ए टैक्टिकल बैकपैक मिलिट्री आर्मी रक्सैक सिक्सटी लार्ज सिक्सटी एल लार्ज एसल्ट पैक डिटैचेबल मॉलिक्यूलर बैग ही विल शो यू हाउ इट इज so the bag it came in like in two to three days within our expectation it came in a soft uh, bag or <laughs> i don't know what uh, amazon started using uh, instead of a um, cardboard bag cardboard box and this is probably difficult to fit in the cardboard box so this is how i got it as you can see it has a main chamber along with a uh, you know good size <coughs> for chamber it has a nice division so you can carry something here and it looks like they are uh, spill proof so we can have the you know water or something there all right so uh, this is what i lined up for uh, to fit in just to give you an e example of what we basically carry for a mat right uh, let's see if that fits in um uh, so basically this is the gun boxes for three guns i have different guns for them as the cz beretta and here i have another uh, so uh, first i'll try to see whether how many of these uh, you know gun boxes is picking up for these are these are default gun boxes uh, provided by the manufacturer. But the European gun manufacturer still provide, you know, a proper a proper box. Um, this one I have to buy. Um, if you buy all this uh, um, ammunition, they are basically uh, self defense ammunition from uh, uh, premium self defense ammunition from Hornady. Uh, it comes uh, with this nice combo. So basically you'll have one critical defense and two pack of uh, Hornady Black and then uh, this three, those three will come with these boxes at a very good price. I mean, uh, there is a the store that uh, provides this deal. I'll, if you guys are interested, I'll may, maybe make another uh, presentation about that. So as you can see in the main chamber, I have been able to fit three three gun boxes and there's still some spare space right so maybe i don't know what else uh maybe i can put the so this is a monarch uh um ruger 115 grain fmj um box i bought i have not used it yet so there are 200 cartridges still there it's quite heavy um as you can expect with 200 cartridges uh, filled in even that I can put in here and there's still more space so I have three uh, mags here with the uh, ammo loaded so I'm just trying to show you what I'll carry this is what we, we guys all carry right for a match or uh, you know if you are using this as a military backpack or assault pack or, or a bug out bag, you'll have those things, right? The guns, the ammo, uh, and then obviously you'll need the eyes and the ears, right? So this is the eye and the ear. Okay, if you are not a shooter, when we say eye and the ear, what we mean is ear protection <laughs> and eye protection. Okay, so this is the ear. So I can put that also here. I have very nice, strong, uh, protective box for uh, eyes actually this also works but the problem with the, I have seen a lot of people uh, shooting with the uh, their uh, reading glass or computer glass but uh, I have also seen you know especially if someone is shooting unusual gun with 45 ACP ammo or like uh, um, especially with hotter ammo like 10 millimeter ammo sometimes their guns eject uh, in, like like for a 9 millimeter well went 9 millimeter it is directly straight out right it, that's true for even a 556 uh, ar15 right it it just ejects the cell right around right angles that those guns do not uh, 45 and 
10 mm, some of them I have seen, that they don't eject straight away. They eject like this. And then the shell comes up somewhere towards the uh, right of the shooter, right? So if someone is shooting here and I'm standing here because next is my turn, sometimes it is like that, right? Uh, or in a range where there is not enough uh, cover between them, some of the range has only small cover, right? It's not fully covered between two shooters. So that might come come over the, you know, like the window panel type cover I have. It will come over that and then fall. And I've seen if those, uh, you know, hot uh, shells get through this kind of, you know, exposure. You see how much exposure I have? This is a nice frame though. This is Opel. I'm sorry, what is that called? This is Oakley, right? Oakley is the preferred, uh, preferred brand for the shooters. It's better than this thing, okay? So that's why you might need to have a full cover glass, right? We carry that. So that will also get in. So for now I have put three, um, actually let me keep these two here because I don't want them to be uh, cast uh, by the, um, this thing, okay? So, I mean, and then I thought I'll put uh, these three uh, glasses, uh, sorry, these three bottles of water. I mean, I can put them here, but as you can see, I can even, uh, <laughs> there's enough, I don't even need the whole bag, right? There's enough space for them uh, to put it in the main chamber. But the problem is when I put it, I have seen it, when I, when I place all this kind of things in the main chamber, I don't find them. It's very difficult, right? After you have, uh, you know, took this in your back and walked for I don't know how many miles, then all of the arrangements. So that's why I prefer to have the small items in their own. Uh, uh, oh, did I put all three? What did I do? Okay. Okay, yeah. This one can stay like the small M, uh, the hmm, eyes, ears, and maybe one. one water or I can place the water or the ear here um, however way it is um, so I'm just thinking because very often when we go after the briefing uh, and before the match starts then we, we put this on because otherwise you'll not be able to listen of course nowadays there are better and more pricier versions available that blocks only high pitch rounds like a gun firing but it doesn't block you know low pitch rounds like someone talking to you so that's also possible but I I don't have that here right now. So see, I didn't even have to use this. Uh, the the thing that I can uh, use this for are the gun loops, gun cleaning kits. There's enough space, you see. Uh, this has uh, uh, AIX box uh, holding my um, prescription sunglass. Uh, this water bottle and this uh, ear and still there is some space here so let me close that all right this is to give you guys how much it can hold i'm not saying that much obviously when you use it for a bug out bag you're going to have some other things if even for a match i'll have a little bit more things like you know the knives and the rods cleaning rod that kind of stuff uh, i have some rags here i forgot to tell you i put some rags here so here we have the ammo, uh, you know, the uh, ammo carry pack. And still there is that, that much space. I don't know, can you see? Yeah, this is like, there is a lot of space. Like at least uh, uh, two liters of space left there. Right, I could carry much more, many more bottles of water if I were to, if I wish to, what happened to that? Okay, sorry, I didn't see it. Okay. So the other thing I like is about the bag, you see how this uh, like uh, the straps are, so obviously I have put in a very heavy stuff and when I am trying to lift it you will see uh, how, how much it has drained me, but so that you know just so that the weight doesn't fall on the chains they have straps here. Like when it's this, it, the steps are going to take some of some weight of it. Right? So similarly, I mean, I can 
I'm not, I'm not tightening this up, but I could so that the weight will not be on the chain. So I, similarly, they have steps on this side also. Like this, they, I could have another of, another such bag here with this strap, right? Similarly, this they have given along with the main bag, but I, I could have another bag here with this strap. And uh, you know, the, how it works is this back stripe goes through this. So they have three holders for that. And then this goes over that to keep it in, keep it tight, right? Similarly for this bag, you see, this one I cannot have another. Oh yeah, I can have another here, right? And then there are stripes, I don't know where I left them. So like this one, um, which is holding it, it could do something. There is a, uh, okay, for this one, there is a strap which you can attach to these two sides and take this out and use it as a bag. You know, women sometimes prefer carrying the uh, gun in a, uh, like a side bag, right? So that you can do it. All right. So I have done, I think I have spoken a lot and I'm starting to have pain with the, my surgical needle here. So let's see. The only thing left is to demonstrate to you how after putting all these things an academic man like me although I am not a typical academic man can easily hold the backpack and walk or jump or do whatever it's supposed to do in your energy so you have the step here so you stay at the right place I think there is a step here too Perfect. Uh, yeah, I got it. Uh, I have a high chest. Uh, okay. I think I can do it. I have to stretch it to the maximum. I have a lot of belly also, but that was not a problem. So meaning people usually have be more belly than me. They have adjusted, but people usually do not have that much high chest like me. So as you can see, I just turn around, I can tighten those if I want, um, you know, I have access to this too, I can take out the bottles if I want, I could tighten this, um, I could tighten the strap here, my hand reaches there, right? if this was not enough I could tighten this strap and this strap, I don't know where it is, this strap, <laughs> okay sorry. So, it's nice, I think. I mean, it's, it's very heavy right now. I have three loaded guns, along with all that link it, and uh, uh, some extra magazines with fully loaded self-defense ammo. Um, I have three bottles of water, one 200, uh, pack, uh, 200 round box of 9mm. What else I had? The ER and the eyes. So, Oh, uh, the final thing is this bag comes with and without the yes flag. I always choose the yes flag because I like it. So, oh, oh, I have to first take the tray. So this is how I'll uh, basically remove the bag if necessary. Okay. And then I pull it out a little bit because it's a very snug fit. I like snug fit. Uh, so. Oh, sorry, it is a bit tight fit. I like tight fit when I'm carrying on shoulder. I don't want it to move up and down or move side by side. So I think it. Okay, the last thing I was saying is it comes with a nice US flag. You can get this with or without it. I got it with it. So that's it. I think I have um, tried to do justice on the back. If you have any more questions, let me know. I'll be happy to answer. Cheers.